Time now for an update from Fox Carolina News and Fox Carolina Weather. Weather rate certified most accurate. Well, good afternoon. We do have a flash flood watch out there. We'll get over to meteorologist Ben Dorenbach get an update on that in just a moment. But breaking news at this hour, we're going to go to our Facebook page at Fox Carolina News, where that is Sheriff Hobart Lewis announcing one arrest in the mass shooting inside Lavish Lounge on Sunday morning. That is where rapper Fujiano had just taken the stage at 1 a.m. 46 minutes later, shots rang out from the stage. 10 people were shot. Two of the victims died. And again, just moments ago, Sheriff Hobart Lewis announcing an arrest has been made. In fact, he says it's the man you see on stage that's been shared all over social media and here on our newscast. You see him with the gun on stage firing into the crowd. That's the one suspect who's been arrested in Georgia. He is cooperating, but there are still several persons of interest. We have those all right here at foxcarolina.com and we'll have those this evening as well. And we'll have much more on what the sheriff is saying, but you can watch this on our Fox Carolina News Facebook page in its entirety. There's video from the body camera footage of the responding deputy clearing the club. Then there's also footage from inside the club they shared this afternoon in this news conference. Uh, some dramatic video showing the chaos that unfolded in that mass shooting that left two people dead and eight others injured. But again, this is all unfolding right now. We'll have much more throughout the evening here at foxcarolina.com and of course on our newscast. Also this afternoon, DHEC releasing new numbers from COVID-19 cases, and now there are 934 new cases as of this afternoon, so down from what we've seen in the last couple of days. However, 19 additional deaths have been reported today. The recovery rate released today is at 87%, so that's some good news as well. And we have the new cases listed by county right here at foxcarolina.com. And an update we've been following all morning long, a family of three who went missing while hiking on Monday in Haywood County found safe around noon today. Uh, they were reported missing around six o'clock on Monday and the big concern was the dense fog we've seen up in Haywood County. They didn't have rain gear, really only had a day pack. But again, they hunkered down overnight and the uh, mother, the father and the young child were found around noon today with only some minor bumps and bruises. So some good news to report this afternoon. Let's go over to meteorologist Ben Dorenbach and Ben, we see that watch behind you. What are we looking at heading into this evening as far as the forecast? Luckily, things have been behaving pretty well. Honest to goodness, I wouldn't be surprised to see this get canceled early, but the fact remains that it is in effect until midnight tonight for our southernmost counties, Elbert, Abbeville, Greenwood, Lawrence and Newberry counties till midnight. Flash flood watch for you. Uh, we've got an area of low pressure pretty much centered right over the area as we record this just after three o'clock this Tuesday afternoon. Once that continues to move northeast, we're going to have spotty showers for the rest of the night and a decent chunk of your Wednesday, but things should eventually dry up a little bit more by the end of the week. I have continuing coverage tonight on the four and five o'clock news, also 10 and 11 Fox Carolina news app and all of our social media platforms. Stay safe. Have a good one.